Modest Lifestyle, welcome back to the channel. If you are new here, my name is Modesta. Please do well to join the family if you haven't. And to my returning subscribers, the Modest Nation, I see you all. Thank you for your massive love and support. It's a reaction video. <laughs> to the table grab whatever that is grabbable grab your juice grab your red wine grab your gogoro grab your pami grab your vodka grab whatever that is grab, grab your water i've got here my water and i have here my banana which size is this one eh extra large you gotta go hey Yalla, 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 let's get started. Who is on this table? King of drama made it to the table. Chine, my own brother. Hey, Ogamaruwa was hanging out with Chine yesterday after Ivan of Ivancho kicked him out like nothing else. Ivancho gave him a soft landing and he's still covering up. What I don't understand is the cover up, you know. He took his community yesterday after I dropped the video of yesterday. Okay. I saw that he posted on his community, Ivan. Let's go through it because we need to take this thing step by step. He got a go. Hey, wonder shall never end. Who else came around? Sultan. Sultan was in lazy members' comment section going up and down. He even carried my video to his channel. I said, hey, Sultan, where is your teddy bear? What is this, Sultan? Sultan said that he came for laughs. He was giggling, enjoying himself in the comment section. Hmm. Okay, Sultan, now what for you? You fall my hand. You fall my hand. Is this one was goose? Because I carry your picture. And that thumbnail. You can't retaliate. <laughs> Guys, you see this, Sultan, eh? Sultan said, Coco Mama, who gave you permission to use my picture as thumbnail? And you get all these small, small YouTubers, all these upcoming wannabe reactors, okay? You are reacting, complaining that Coco Mama is on the neck of Marwa. And you are on my neck. <laughs> hey, is this one not Keto calling pot black, guys? Drop in the comment section and let me know. There was this reactor, Kenyan reactor, that always come here. Carry my thumbnail like this. Confusing lazy members. He wants to really bring confusion to this street so that when you see my video, you will not recognize that this is my video. This is why it's called customized thumbnail. If you don't know how to do it, you have to learn. You don't go and screenshot my thumbnail and carry it and put on your own video and come and be condemning me and saying that my channel is about to be deleted. Now your channel, brother, Huh? Yeah. You want to use me and learn work. You are just a reactor like me. You are against what I am in support. You want me to agree to your own opinion when you know what agree to my own. Is it possible? You know possible now. It get as it be. It be as it gets. Brother, my small advice to you is you don't start your YouTube by copying other people's work. Okay, thumbnail, you can take somebody's picture. You can take a screenshot of my thumbnail, use my picture and form your own thumbnail. You don't go and carry my thumbnail. Almost all your videos now, since you started this reaction, it's working for you. I saw it. Kudos to the guy that you interviewed. This guy gave it to you very, very nicely. You wanted this guy to condemn Coco Mama. And this guy was like, what's your problem? Stop it. Leave her to do her thing. You must not agree. We are here to, you know, shook our mouth, agree, disagree, learn, unlearn, and relearn. In fact, eh, hmm, I was very happy when he brought that guy, because that guy really, really gave it to him. You want to pick on us. Anytime we drop video, you guys will carry it and counteract it. Hey, copy and paste will not kill some of these reactors, upcoming wannabe reactors. You guys should be coming down. No? 
why is all of a sudden Sultan coming up to talk now? I was asking myself, why, why now? Why right after your friend Ivan, I am Marowa, broke up? Why is it now that you are coming around? Lazy people everywhere. Look at you guys. You guys are too much. I love you or die. You got that go? Mm. Even Ivan. Mm? Ivan is busy everywhere. During the premiere of my best black beauties, shout out to you. Ivan was there also. Ivan was reacting at the comment section. Ivan claimed that Marowa actually blocked him. That he did not unfollow Marowa. Rather, Marowa was the one that blocked him. You guys, you know what it means for someone to block someone? It means that the person is really, really what? Pissed off. Is it not? You triggered him to take that action. He will not just block you for no reason. If you get what I mean. Mm. Yes, let's read Ivan's community post he dropped yesterday. About what is going on between him and Marwa. Mm. He actually did this trying to clear the air. But actually, he made us more confused. Mm. Overthinking will not kill some of us here. Let's look at it. So guys, let's read the community post from Adventure. Due to the recent event and people's inquiries, I want to respond to some questions that followers have. I didn't kick at Marwa out of my house. In fact, I notified him with plenty of notice for him to make arrangements. At I am Marwa is a traveler with many people around the world ready to host him. In addition, he is financially able to make travel arrangements, as all travelers do. This morning, he left. I offered to drive him to the metro, and as I was in a hurry, and he declined and said he would take an Uber. He calmly left when his arrangements were made. I will not badmouth the man I once called a friend. I believe things happen in life and it's time to move on. We have a few collaborations together already filmed. Those videos will be released regardless. I do not plan to discuss this matter publicly, but I will respond and give my version if I am compelled to. Thanks, Ivan. Guys, hey, when I saw this, eh, I was boiling. I was very, very mad when I got this community. But I said, what is wrong with this guy? What is wrong with you, Ivan Chong? Man up. This is not how a man behaves. Don't behave like a woman. You talk too much. This is not how a man should handle matter like this. One word that you drove out of the house. Didn't even take it this serious, the way you took it. Must you respond to every question asked? I'm asking you, Ivan. Is it by force that you must answer people? Yes, people know already. But for you to come and be, be trying to defend yourself, make yourself look good, is childish to me. That is not how to do things as a man. We all knew that this thing happened suddenly. Whatever that transpired, it happened suddenly. So this one you are saying is a cock and bull story. Honestly speaking, guys, I have to be honest here. Ivan went to the airport, picked this Polish girl, okay, together with Marwa. And Marwa was telling this girl, let's watch the video. Because if I'm saying it like this, you guys will still, it will still not enter. Mm. So let's watch. Marwa told this girl, are you happy to stay here? And the girl said yes. Amara was even asking her, I know you didn't enjoy this food because you ate on the plane. So obviously, I will know whether you like my Kenyan food next time. You know? And you can see, I've already planned to do this to Marwa. That is not how to do things. You want to settle with someone you don't drop that person because for you to point out that you did not kick him you kicked him 100% because you guys forgot that you guys you 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 are you are writing this forgetting that 
there were videos that you guys made prior to that like this one that i'm about to share guys all right guys we're leaving the airport and uh heading home uh mom you okay all right as long as you arrived you're okay you're gonna have a great time. <laughs> Later now, we shall be showing you more and uh, yeah, more videos coming. She's here to stay, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Did you enjoy the food? Yes. Oh, but you're still like kind of full because they give you food in the plane. Yes. So technically, she didn't enjoy that much. But <laughs> <laughs> so, but tomorrow and the day after, now when like she really feels hungry, that's when now you'll tell. Okay, guys. So. So guys, you can see prior to Marwa leaving Ivan's home, alleged home, mm -hmm. you guys, I saw all your comments. You guys were telling me how Ivan is a big fish, a veteran, is actually easy. Some of you guys even said that you have Googled and you found out that the home belongs to him. You guys can convince me more. Convince me more. Eh? I don't understand this thing. Eh? Lazy people everywhere. Look at you. Look at you leave me alone. Look at you guys. Leave me alone. What is this? <laughs> you want me to take your own opinion, but you don't want to take mine. What is this? Carry your own. I've told you people that opinion is like a handbag. When you carry your own like this, you protect it. You don't want anything to fall out from your handbag. That's the same way I carry my own opinion. I carry it like this until I am truly, really, really deeply convinced. Lazy people everywhere. Look at your life. Marwa telling this Maria, are you happy to be here? Are you going to stay with us? Guys, expect more videos. Even Ivan said it. And did you hear Marwa saying, we're heading home? If Marwa had plans to move out from Ivan's home prior to the incident that happened marwa will definitely share it and guys this is third time marwa is saying it that ivan drove him out reason because his uncle died and he was gonna travel okay you offered to drop him off at the train station for what reason that one is medicine after death you just like all of a sudden you kick somebody without letting the person have his plans in place after he welcomed a lady 18 hours this lady traveled from poland to visit america and all of a sudden you've decided to do this dude this is not how to do things and this one that you dropped on your community is what we call information overload marwa unblocked me certain things you keep it because you don't know yet if this issue can be resolved. So it's too quick for you to react just because people are asking questions, just because you want to clean yourself. You want to come out clean like, oh, because we have been dragging Marwa. You, don't, you guys don't know. If you guys know how we operate here, we don't spare anybody. If you are wrong, we will come out here and talk about it. Even if you try to offend somebody that we are against, you think we will support you because of that? Hell no. After all, prior to this, you were making attempts by all means. Marwa did not even know how to report a channel. Marwa called you specifically. Ivan, show me how do we report this. And you were teaching people how to do it. You were teaching people during that live stream how to report Coco Mama, how to delete this channel. This channel must go down because she's too much. She's talking too much. Why is she touching areas that she's not supposed to touch? <laughs> who gave her the audacity to be saying all these things? Does she know who I am? Hmm? To be talking about me like this? What is her business? You did all that. You actually held Marwa like this to make sure that he used his platform to come against me. Hmm? is not how to do things dude dude you are ungrateful marua helped you from 3000 subscribers now you are sitting with 11000 prior to that nobody knew you on this street what did you do when this guy got 10000 subscribers a few days ago he wrote this on his community without even saying thank you to marua eh? we 
without acknowledging and appreciating Marua. What is his reason? He has done it privately. Something that someone did publicly. Oh, guys, go support Ivan, sharing you on his community. Something that he did publicly. You, you will go privately and say thank you to him. Does that make sense? Let's read it, guys. So Ivan took his community to write this when he hit 10k subscriber. He said, we just hit 10k, you all. I want to say thank you for all. Your time, your support. YouTube is a journey that I enjoy very much. There's a lot of content out there. But you chose to watch mine from time to time. Or even a little bit. And I appreciate that. Traveling is a privilege that I know many people can't afford. Or simply don't have the time to. It's a passion of mine. And I want to motivate people to travel more. I also want people who can't go to at least to get more information or travel visually with my videos editing the way i do takes a lot of time but it is out of respect for your time i choose to produce the best quality i can i can i will continue to improve i'm open to criticism you are not okay ivan you are not open to criticism okay ivan you are not open to criticisms if you are you will not come after the reactors. You will not try to delete my channel. Yes. You will not come with full force to attack reactors. You will not do it. So you are not open to any criticism. At all. And actually, I regard this your post as a hate speech. Actually. And I will tell you why. I am open to criticism as it's the only way to learn. Don't be shy. Hit me up on here, email or Instagram, and I will respond to your genuine constructive criticisms. Thank you again to you all. To my haters, I have so much more for you to be mad at. Just be patient. You see why? Why focusing on haters? If you don't have haters, you're not ready to grow. If you don't have haters, you are not ready to grow and when somebody disagree with you or disagree with your favorite person or disagree with your friend it doesn't make that person a hater it doesn't mean that that person hates you it simply means that this person is saying that you see this thing you said mm -mm, i disagree i don't agree with you it doesn't make sense to me okay and that does not warranty anybody to start insulting because you will not tell me you have been following marawa Marwa is not someone that you just know yesterday. You've known Marwa for over a year. Okay? You will not say that you've not seen Marwa insulting us. Even with his community post. If you say that you don't know that Marwa has been insulting us, calling us different names. West African old ladies. We need deliverance. Witches. Wizard. Banned from the village. Looking weird. Catching bread. If you will claim that you don't know all that, then I don't know. Maybe truly you are not watching Marwa. Just like the way you drop this community post without appreciating him. Guys, tell me who does things like this. Even if you have given him shelter and so what, you will write a speech like this. Someone that made it possible, not even to say thank you. Ivan, you are ungrateful. That's all I can tell you. I'm an ungrateful person. You have a problem. You've not even allowed the person that you've thrown outside to say something. He is still talking in parable. And for Marwa to say this three times, Ivan's uncle died. That Ivan told him that he was traveling back to Cameroon. For Marwa to say it three consecutive times, it means that really, really, that was the way you threw him out. That was the excuse you gave him before you drove him out of your house. It's as simple as that. Dialogue. Say what you mean and mean what you say. I've warned Ivan before. I said, Ivan, be careful. Now that you are supporting Maru, everything he says, you are supporting. The first collaboration, you actually came licking ass, looking for this guy, because you knew your intention. As soon as you got to 10,000, you dropped him. Because you have, you feel like you have gotten what you are looking for. After all, what he said to you. This guy that is even stingy, can't pay for transport, can't buy his food, can't pay for accommodation. Who is he? This is what Nigerians call see finish. That's what you did to him. And that is where 
I will respect Sultan more. Sultan is straight up. Sultan hosted Marwa before. Probably felt that, okay, you know what? I know this dude. I've been with him before. He has spent time in my house before. I can't do it again. Maybe I can do one or two days, but I can't do it again. But this Ivan came acting up. Came to the airport. He was not even staying in New York. He had to travel down for how many hours to pick up Marwa. After using him, after knocking him, knocking him, knocking him, you discarded him like this. And after you discarded him, how can Marwa just block you for... How can... Guys, is it possible? Marwa will just block Ivan for nothing. It's not possible now. Somebody that he has made it very clear that Ivan is one of those people that if Ivan is calling him, he will not say, oh, who is this? He will say, oh, Ivan is calling. Meaning that he placed him somewhere close to his heart. Meaning that Ivan means so much to Marwa. After you showed him all these flashy, flashy things, you did not even allow him to use it. You did not, you did not, even, you did not even allow, you did not even bring it to the table and be like, you know what, Marwa? I don't think this will work. Why are you bringing this girl? Even before the girl flew in. And I was thinking, overthinking will not kill us, guys. I was thinking, probably this Ivan was mad. Let's say that Marwa even bought the ticket for Maria to come from Poland to US. But he cannot buy food. He cannot bring out money for small, small things here and there. Because there was a day they were arguing in the shop. Marwa wanted Ivan to buy some tomato. Ivan claimed that he doesn't need tomato. And Mara was like, buy it, buy it. You guys will have seen the drama of money. So we can see that it's so clear that Mara being the stingy guy, okay, that doesn't like to spend his money. Ivan, because of YouTube growth, because he knows his aim, because he wants to achieve his goals, which is growing his channel, he was tolerating all that nonsense from Marwa. Because if I was in his position, Put YouTube growth aside as a friend. You sit him down and be like, Marwa, this is America. This is not Africa. You need to freaking bring out this money that you are making on YouTube. You need to freaking bring and support like this, like this. I'm also hustling like you. You know, talk to him off camera. Because at the end of the day, he will even appreciate the fact that you gave him roof. Okay? At least he has roof over his head. He's not paying for accommodation. And Marwa is someone, if he's appreciating all this hospitality, he doesn't hide it. The other day he was making joke in Sultan's home. He says, Sultan, you have tried for us. If not because of you, how can I pay for hotel? I would have suffered. I would have gone hungry. If not because of you, Sultan, I wouldn't be able to eat. And they were all laughing. The same thing that he said, not even up to one week. He made statements like that. You threw him away. That you are going to bury your uncle. And made him look like he's a liar. Because Marwa cannot say this three times. And you guys will tell me that Marwa is just making up this story. This is exactly what Ivan told him. Marwa, I'm traveling to Cameroon. You need to go. How can you come and lie publicly like this? When we know. Marwa was even telling this... Uh, Poland girl, oh, let's go home. I hope you will stay. I hope you are happy. He was even telling Maru at the airport, oh, Maru, I'm happy for you because you have a companion now. You won't be bored anymore. And before this girl came, being somebody that hosted Maru, there's no way Ivan did not know that this girl was coming. Probably when they were making the arrangement, making all the phone calls and all that, he knew about it. He was pretending. So that he will grab everything he needs. After he finished, he's the same one that ran to his community. Just like what he did to Marwa with Priya Shama. He was the one that broke them up. As soon as he saw Marwa, he started this conversation for his channel. Selfishness. Oh, what can you do? Oh, next time we're going to call uh, Priya Shama. Okay, the next video, guys, we're going to call Priya Shama and see if Priya Shama will take uh, Marwa's call. What's your problem? Why doing stuff like that? They made sure that they destroyed little relationship Marwa had with Priya Shama. Not even they, him. It was too much on him because he was, he was the one recording. I did not even know that Sultan has 
a YouTube channel, if not yesterday, that he came to the channel to drop comments. I didn't know. He was not recording. He was just driving to the airport. I found was the one with the camera. Recording everything until there was issue. He came back again to put all the blames on Marwa. Oh, Marwa, don't you think that you should keep some of these things private? Do you want, do you wish to continue sharing your relationship publicly? Eh? You blow hot, you blow cold. That is not how to do things. Everybody knows that Marwa is stingy. We said it here. I was laughing when they did window shopping. Because they came out from that shop, didn't buy anything. Of course, I knew it. Didn't I say it, guys? That Ivan will not buy because Ivan knew that Marwa can buy anything he wants to buy. But some people are like that. Some people, they are stingy. Like They are stingy to even to change their clothes. This uh, Mark Zuckerberg, you will always see him wearing one t-shirt like this and say pass. Meanwhile, he's, he's one of the richest people on earth. Meanwhile, he's one of the richest people in the world. But he lives a very simple life. Some people are like that. Because I don't believe that Marwa is not making at least 10,000 US dollars. Marwa is making money. Just like Coco Mama now. I will come and lie to you people that, oh, I'm not making anything on YouTube. If you're looking at me, you will know I'm lying. Because at all, at all, if I don't make, at least I will make 200, 300, 400, depending. If you are still starting, it's not easy. Because also you guys know uh, CPM and RPM and what, 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 which determines how much we make. But even if he's not making up to what the buyer is making, like some of you lazy people, lazy people everywhere. <laughs> some of you, you don't calculate already the kind of content that the buyer drops compared to the kind of content that Marwa makes that... Of course, Wodemeyer's content will give him more money. And Wodemeyer's content is content that doesn't expire. You know, Marwa's content is like this, our Akroko. It gets to a time that nobody will watch it. Because the news has passed. Okay? Except if he has gone to like a place that people would want to Google, like uh, some of his videos in Colombia. People still watch and connect to it. So it depends on the content again. I'm not trying to bad, bad mouth. I really feel sorry for Marwa. The good thing again is Marwa met up with this guy, Chinedu, a Nigerian guy from my tribe, actually. Yes. So Marwa met this Chinedu, not first time. As a big fish that he is, connection is not his problem. But again, he wants to stay where he feels comfortable. He wants to stay where he feels that, okay, I've known these people. I trust them with my life. Marwa will not just go anywhere. Oh, Marwa, come and stay in my house. He will go. You have to be conscious of your safety, okay? He will not just accept all the offer. And I'm very, very sure that just like the way he took his community to ask for people to host him, he will get so many offers. Now he got a Kenyan family. And he was making joke because the Ugali that he was supposed to make in Ivan's place, he couldn't cook it. This is someone that said that I've given him enough time to make his plans. Why didn't you put it to the table that Marwa will be here for a short time? I will be hosting Marwa for a short time. Looking at what happened to them now, it's totally opposite of what Marwa has been saying. Marwa has been saying that, oh, we are processing visa to South America. If South America doesn't work, he will be going to Caribbeans. He doesn't want to go to Caribbeans because he has been to Caribbean. He wants to go to South America, Argentina, all these places. Okay? So, they were running that visa process together. There was nothing like, oh, Marwa will stay with me for... And you will always hear this Ivan making it very clear that he's the host of Marwa. But the only problem is money. That one, we saw it. <laughs> I saw it very clear. It was written all over. That Ivan didn't like the fact that he was the one paying. Nothing goes for nothing. He helped you grow your channel. You should appreciate that. Not even to say a simple thank you to him in your community post. And you claim that you said thank you to him privately. Eh? When you know that as a friend that this is the problem I have. 
address it with me. Don't leave it till the last minute. You are already planning with uh, your cousin what to do because the movement and everything showed. The movement, the way you guys stepped aside and was talking while Marwa was talking to other guests, it was so clear that you already had your plans in place on how and what you are going to tell him to get rid of him. And why when this Polish girl came, why? Why did all these things happen when this Maria arrived? You followed Marwa to pick her from the airport. Yes, Marwa, Marwa was at the back of that car with that Maria. That one is not good. Truth be told, because Ivan is not your Uber driver. So there's no way you will, you know, leave Ivan alone in front of the car to sit with this girl. This girl is supposed to sit at the back of that car alone. That's how to do things. But if I was Ivan, I can correct that as well. Marwa, come in front. But you know Ivan is this type of person that will keep quiet. And the day that he will bust out, he will really bust out and finish everything. And then destroy everything and run to his community. And be blabbing nonsense. This is medicine after death. You didn't kick him out. He blocked you on IG. You didn't keep, you gave him enough time, but he kept on saying that, let's go home. Oh, are you happy to be here? Oh, I will be around until I get this. We didn't hear Marwa saying that he was going to move somewhere or Ivan is hosting me for a short time because you know Marwa will say everything. Guys, now that Marwa is in this Airbnb apartment, he's giving a little hint. Okay, he started again by saying that Ivan lost his uncle and Ivan told him that he was traveling. And prior to that, something, something happened, which he was not ready to share. But with time, we know that these things will come out. Ivan also is saying that if he's prompted to talk, he will come out and talk. He's already talking by claiming that Marwa blocked him. How can Marwa just block you if you have given him time? If you have given him time, you will probably be the one to drop him wherever he's going because you made it clear that Marwa, I'm going to host you from this period to that period because of financial implications there or whatever reason. These things couldn't have happened. You wanted to force yourself so that this content and look at him now, regardless, he's going to drop all these videos, regardless. <laughs> I thought I have seen it all, guys. I blame people that think that Marwa used Ivan. I'm sorry for you guys. <laughs> hey, if you have not grown a YouTube channel, it's just like how Ivan was running his mouth. Oh, this audience, you chose to watch my video. They are from Marwa. This, this audience you were addressing, they are 100% Marwa's audience. So you deserve to call his name out the way you tag him two times in this year, yeah, 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 right up you wrote now. You're supposed to freaking tag him and say thank you to him, especially, not privately, openly. Because he helped you openly. Why saying thank you to him privately? Guys, African Dominican lazy member, shout out to you, baby girl, was asking him, my man, you forgot to say thank you tomorrow. This happened six days ago. When Marwa was still with him, that would tell you the kind of person he is. We have been having issues with Marwa, with threats, having a lawyer. Marwa has never come out to his community and teach people how to go and report our channels. The person that has done something like that is African team. But Marwa has never done it. We have been reacting on Marwa's video for the past four months. Yes, he is insulting us. He's saying crazy stuff to us, calling us names. But he has never taken it to this level of teaching people how to go and take down my channel. As soon as he came to America, and immediately you had, but now you are running kitty kitty everywhere, reacting, covering yourself, protecting your reputation. Feel that we are babies. We are not children. We know these things. It's very clear. Guys, let's continue. African Dominican said, Congrats, you forgot to thank Ayam Marwa. 
your many USA collaboration with him definitely got you to 10k in record time. Your editing is impeccable too. Okay? And Ivan replied and said, thanks so much. I did congratulate him in person and on Instagram. We are together in person, as you know. Thanks for your feedback. You are together. So what is happening today since you are together in person? Do you remember when you said that if you want your money back from GoFundMe, the person should hit you on IG, that you are ready to refund the money? That Marwa is your friend. Marwa can ask for donation. You forgot all that. You said Marwa deserves to do whatever he wants to do. Beg for money because content creation, people don't make a lot of money all the time. You forgot. We want to remind you. You remember that you said it in front of us that you are not complaining that Mara doesn't spend money. That you are not complaining that Mara is not contributing to the food, transport, you are driving him around. You remember that? Anyway, that is that one, guys. Let's move to Marwa. Meeting this Chinedu. My first impression when I saw both of them together, okay? Let's watch this clip. Bro, introduce yourself. Yeah, hey, I'm um, Chinedu and yes. I'm from Nigeria. Maro is my friend and... Uh, We've known each other now. For, for long. Yeah. And... Uh, and I'm happy he's back, back again. We were, we were yeah. with him. I think you guys maybe have seen some of the videos I did. He took me around. Yeah, man. Uh, so now he, we, we, he's helping me actually fix my visa situation, like moving me around. You know, actually traveling around the US. We can go, my brother, no yeah. problem. Yeah. There's a small camera here, Osmo. I'm gonna be putting his, his uh, YouTube uh, channel name, okay? Is, um, let's go, man. We're yeah. gonna get late. Okay. Yes. Nice. Yes. Chinedu, man, yes. you look like the governor of DC. <laughs> Consulate, I tried. To... Hey, Chinedu. Yeah. You can pick me up the same point, man. They say that I can't go in without an appointment. Okay, so Marwa met this Chinedu. Chinedu is not his host. Host is Kenyan. I think his host was host him in two days or something. Okay. Chinedu just met up with him drove him to the embassy to do his visa processing and all whatnot okay the first impression i got here is marwa being marwa marwa will control no matter what even if he's dying and you can see everybody is worried about marwa oh we hope he's okay his uh, airbnb location is not good that neighborhood is dangerous he can be shot he can be doing this one he can be doing this he can go through this everybody's worried about marwa but do you think he's worried about himself? No. Chinedu is the one driving you. It's Chinedu petrol. What do you guys call it in US? It's Chinedu's gas. It's Chinedu's car. Okay? Guess who is running his mouth? Let's go, let's go, let's go. Not once, twice. And when Chinedu dropped him at the embassy, it happened that the embassy did not allow him to go in because he was not having appointments. Okay? So the embassy told him that he can only come in on appointment. He started calling Chinedu back to get him at the same place he dropped him. What is he trying to do? Save money. Stinginess. He was even saying that US is expensive for him. And he's always checking over. If the place is far, he's not going to call the over. <laughs> so this is Marwa. You see? This is inbuilt this is in his blood there's nothing you can do that will you know as an adult it's gonna be difficult he's not behaving the way he's behaving because he was with ivan or because he was with sultan this is him and i like the way sultan handled him if you know that this person is putting you off even if you are going to gain something from him you probably keep that one aside because you now you need to outweigh. You need to weigh and outweigh. Am I going to gain or lose at the end of the day? Don't force yourself to do these things. And at the end of the day, you will hurt someone. Because again, Marwa was telling this children, let's go, let's go, let's go. And then trying to sound funny and trying to make some joke. Telling Chinedu that he looks like the governor of DC. In DC, apparently, they don't have governor. Somebody was making joke in the comment section that 
Mara has been traveling without understanding what is going on. That in DC they don't have governor. But you can see him controlling Chinebu with his power. That's Marwa for you. He controls people. He controls everybody around. He's a control freak. He controls everybody. Almost everybody. He controls even his mom. Mm -hmm. Let's see what to do. Now I need to check on my Uber and see which place is actually far. If a place is far, I will avoid it. Yeah. So let's see. Is it a small kid looking at me saying, Oh, who is this guy? Blogging. Anyway, guys, this is a struggle. This is total struggle. It's no joke. It's not exciting. And some people are concerned what's going on. So Ivan's uncle passed on. And Ivan told me he has to leave for Africa. Uh, that's all. That's all. Uh, other more information uh, is totally irrelevant because uh, we don't have put some other informations out there. But uh, that's what happened. So I'll put some information not public uh, because I don't find it uh, interesting to put it public. But all in all is he told me his uncle passed on. But there were some issues, but not major issues, you know. So his uncle passed on and he said it was his the last uncle that he knew. So he had to fly out. So I couldn't stay in his house. So, but all in all, uh, I leave it to, I don't know. I wanted to say to God, but I'm like, maybe I leave it to me and him. And <laughs> okay. Did you hear Mara was saying that there was issue prior to Ivan telling him that he lost his uncle? There was issue. And Ivan is saying the opposite, that he gave Marwa time to find his way out. Which one is which one? There was issue, but I don't want to make it public. I leave it for God. I leave it between me and Ivan. I gave him time to move. I did not throw him out. Guys, which one do we follow? You see this life? Mm. This life, whatever you are doing in this life, Make sure that you keep your hands upright because what goes around comes around. Karma doesn't forget. Karma doesn't forget the address. Karma will wake you up in the middle of the night and be like, Ngo, eat it. That is karma. How many days now? Not up to five days. They wanted to pull down this channel. What did I do? We are agreeing here and there, making joke here and there. Has it even gotten to that extent of pulling someone's sweat? Pulling someone's channel down. It looks easy to Ivan. He got these 7,000 subscribers from Marwa and he feels it's easy. He was standing there teaching people. Teaching people how to delete the channel, go and report. He feels it's easy. Because he got some umbrella. As soon as Marwa arrived at the airport, he carried Marwa like this. Took Marwa very fast. Vlogging, vlogging, vlogging. I will even say at this point that the only person that gave Marwa genuine and warm welcome to US is Sultan. That's all I can say here. As for Ivan, I said it now. View is not your mate. I said it. Even when Lorin was supporting Marwa, telling us that we are envious. Ivan said the same thing. Oh, they are also blasts, pulling down on other blasts. They are fighting. They are talking shit. They are doing this. They are doing that. I said it very clearly that they were doing all that for their own benefit. If not, why can't you sit someone down and tell the person your mind and be like, you know what? I, I can't take this from you. Carry your stinginess. I cannot. This is America. I can't. I cannot do this one. Maybe we will meet up and have our collaboration. You look for somewhere to stay. I stay with my cousin. Some people saying that Marwa was putting camera too much on their faces. Why didn't Ivan sit down with Marwa and address this issue in such a way 
that it will not end like this? That's my question. Drop your thoughts in the comment section, okay? And tell me what you think about this issue going on between Ivan and Marwa. As for me, I am not happy. That's all I can say. I'm not happy because if I was in this situation, if I was in Ivan's shoe, I wouldn't have let this explode like this. Covering up, covering up. Oh, he's my friend. Oh, he can beg. Oh, he can ask for donation. Oh, I'm not complaining. Oh, what are friends for? We are here to support one another. Mara is my best friend. Mara is also saying, no, Ivan is my friend. Ivan will be the manager of my brand. Ivan, Ivan will do this. Ivan is coming to Kenya. I'm planning for Ivan to come to Kenya to get a land and build like mine. And they were all deceiving each other. Shallow, shallow friendship. Deep down, this Ivan didn't wish Marwa well. Because if he had wished Marwa well, the one you will put it out there. Marwa, this is all I can do for you. You see, this other one is not gonna work. Guys, I don't want anybody to feel that, oh, he helped, he helped, he helped, but he didn't know his limits. He was shy to put it through Marwa that, you see this one, I can do this one, this one, I cannot do it. He was shy for his own selfish reasons. And it got to a point that it was choking him. Because if I was the one, Marwa would not bring that Polish girl home. Because I would be like, Marwa, this girl that you want to bring, where do you plan to bring her? In this house? When you know that you don't like to spend money. No, Marwa. If you must bring this girl, please arrange and you guys should go somewhere. Jokingly, jokingly, he will understand. Either he cancel bringing the girl or he make a plan B. Ja, ja, ja. Marwa has fame. I can give him places. People, people that will be willing to host him. I think his worries might even be his safety, you know, making sure that he's somewhere that he will be safe. Not that he doesn't have people that he can stay with. And at the end of the day, that person will even benefit. And you guys know Marwa. He will not use you and leave you, especially if you are a content creator. If you are not a content creator, it's different. But if you are a content creator, he will not just use you and leave you. He will always say, give yourself shout out. Guys, let's go and give them 1,000. Though if you offend him, you will collect it back. We know Marwa. And even when you are not a content creator, Marwa is someone that will force you. If you can see the potentials that you can do well on YouTube, you'll be like, okay, just like what he did to that yeah. Colombian girl. Yeah, 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 he made her open a YouTube channel instantly. And that girl is sitting with 1,000 plus. That 1,000 plus, ask anybody that struggled here on YouTube like us what it takes. To get that 1,000 subscribers, it's not my money. All right, guys, if you watch to this moment, do not forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Tell a friend to tell a friend about my life, and I will see you in my another reaction. Peace out. Peace out. Peace out. Peace out. Bye bye. You be my queen, I don't need no rules. It's a love song, I don't need no blues. You be my sugar, I don't need no juice. Baby, loving you is a must, yeah. Whatever I do.